Day two of the convention was marked again by protests. Many Bernie Sanders supporters walked out after the roll call, ensuring Hillary Clinton's nomination. Overall, she received 60 percent of the votes. And at the end, Sanders moved to nominate Clinton by acclamation. It was a gesture of unity at an historic moment. Gail and I asked people on the convention floor what the moment meant to them. One of the first to speak during the delegate count was 102-year-old Jerry Emmett. Arizona, 51 votes for the next president of the United States of America, Hillary Rodham Clinton. Tonight, on this night, we will shatter that glass ceiling again. We tonight gave respect to the legacy of all of the courage that came before us. And we tonight began a journey that we must make a reality in November, electing the first woman to be president of the United States of America. Hillary Clinton will be our first woman president. I helped make this happen in a way, and I'm hugely humbled by it. It's something that I'm going to do that's going to make a difference for my granddaughters. We must do everything we can to make sure that Hillary becomes our next commander in chief. We are preparing to shatter the highest, strongest marble ceiling in our country by electing Hillary Clinton president of the United States. You're crying. Why are you crying? I'm sorry. Uh, I'm crying because this is a very personal moment. All in favor of the motion say aye. Opposed, no. The ayes have it. We just put the biggest crack in that glass ceiling yet.